think you're fake and I'm just I don't know how that's and that actually changed. Never happy that we won't want. Like you're just traveling to Mexico. Like I get in your brain and you start thinking you are the problem because it's very easy to get If it's for a thing of gender equality, then things should be balanced. Yeah, but not I want myself a blind to think of the person that gets myself this girl. Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Fun Pop with Lillian. So after the Oriflame task, Messi and Kim decided to have a conversation regarding the whole game, alliances, strategy, nominations, eviction. And Messi opened up with to Kim, telling her that with the way Lucy and Prince left, that in fact she has concluded that you are a fake housemate, that you for a fake housemates and at that she nominated you that she put you up for eviction and kim was like yes of course she felt that because she herself even told big brother that with the way prince and lucy left you know that he has really put a bit on their head that the housemates now will start suspecting they are fake housemates and she went ahead to tell messi why would anybody even that she doesn't even blame anybody for thinking that way that she herself could have thought that same way too and messi said don't worry i'll go around and tell everybody right now that you're not a fake my housemate i was even like her god i beg you that kim should not get evicted you know but then the funny thing that happened kim now asked her how, what and what made you suspect that and messi said that even why the h o h was being played that omashola was you know just being sluggish and slow with putting his balls that they were the ones gingering him like oh you know do now and he said he doesn't want to be h-o-h and kim now replied her telling her oh that's because of the whole back pain that maybe that's the reason why big brother now has to say oh h-o-h can send anybody on errand honestly i give it to kim for coming through back to back with replies and answers that will make Messi not assume those people are fake housemates and she was even telling kim um kim was even telling Messi that she was really angry with omashola for not making her a bff that she was just angry and omashola even had to apologize for picking um the rest of the girls while Messi have told her not to be offended that she will help in, uh, you know spread the news that she's not fake Messi told her that another reason why she picked her is she wanted okay if this person is a fake housemate that means you know that one doesn't count that her plan is that from next week she will start nominating those that she knows the, if they if she stand with them she has a chance of not going meanwhile Ile Baye decided to pour out her anger the whole thing that happened between her and Alex so according to Ile Baye she said while they were in the arena during the oriflame task a ball hit her and someone told her it was alex that threw that ball and when she thought to turn to uh, to talk to alex you know alex acted indifferently and then that adekule was not like oh that suits you and she was now wondering why would such a thing happen and that was why she was not even happy when her group was announced although ile baye and alex have sorted themselves out she was now narrating it to white money and white money was just you know trying to calm her down Telling her that all that does not count now, that she should learn how not to allow little things stop her from celebrating her wins. White money even jokingly told her, can't you see now we are going to Mexico? <laughs> and everybody was like, ah, are we going to Lex uh, Mexico? And White said, I'm just joking. But you know, 1.250 million, ah, it's something now, it's huge. Meanwhile, Venita tells her decoly that she has a problem with how things are done in this house. That the ladies here are always talking about um, women equality, yet they are so entitled. That it was in this house that she first witnessed where men cook, where men wash, where men clean the house. That what are these ladies doing? First time I saw the guy cook, I told you. Right. I can't have thought as much that you guys put me up anyways yeah, because, because I'm nothing. like, I like to eat the food. Vanita said if the ladies of the house really want to talk about women equality, then they should go ahead and get things done by themselves without 
relying on the guys and i quickly even mentioned how for every time he tries to cook or is cooking alex will go around and ask him oh what are you cooking what are you cooking and i'm like wahala can't someone ask you what you're cooking again but then i is trying to say that alex is asking not because she wants to know but so you know she gets a share after the meal is done meanwhile alex confides in doing that she doesn't feel really good about the whole being close to winning and not winning that she has been giving all her best to task this season being that the last time she was here people outside said viewers said oh she doesn't take task seriously so she's trying to like like kind of you know erase that narrative about her not being serious with task and she said this time around she's putting on her energy that if her, she's even tired yet winnings are not coming often and she said well that yesterday she was rejoicing with white money's team and she now asked her white money how many times have you won and white money said oh i've not been winning anything no that they just started winning and she was like oh that means she's not really doing bad like she thought but doing told her you know not to feel that way that's the game the task has a way of making you feel that way you will try to blame your team or you feel oh maybe luck is not on your side and all that that is just the task that she's even lucky she's loved what about her that is not winning task and is not being loved that she has not been finding it easy in the house or that the house has been really tough for her that can you imagine prince came here picked immunity and handed it over to you that who in this house will even hand her immunity nobody that nobody loves her to that extent of doing such a thing for her i have not really been easy for her both task wise friendship wise and general living in the house that well you know you can't just open your mouth now and start sh and start shouting or crying on how you feel about the house but she went ahead to encourage um alex not to feel any kind of way Meanwhile, upstairs, Sissy has told her fellow BFF that with the way she has been feeling lonely in this house, moving forward, any available guys she sees, she will just go ahead and cuddle the person. Except for Moshola, who has declared that, you know, he's married and the wife says this one is no go area. That moving forward, uh, she will get herself hooked up. Uh. While in the lounge, Neil, Perry, Cross and Kim are already planning life after the show and they started talking about christmas and you said wish they can all just go to ghana and go for the afro nation and be afro waiting waiting um carnival that it's always hot you know he went ahead to narrate his last last experience while in ghana how it's all the phone and everything you vibe your network and why kim was asking them can't such thing be done in nigeria and cross said you know within security in nigeria that even going for such a thing you can one can actually go but the will vibe to an extent and kim started again with them or oh, no that there is no insecurity like that in nigeria <laughs> that is like that everywhere in the world she be um Patricia CEO even got robbed in LA. That is general disease all over the world. That is not specular, it's not peculiar to Nigeria. Why can't people have fun? That people party and have fun in Nigeria now. Because some people really have the worst. We might not be crying out in public. I can just go to Nottingham Carnival before. Yeah, I can go to Nottingham Carnival before. Yeah, I can go to Nottingham Carnival before. Adikule gisted Veneta on how his fan base doesn't joke with him, how he's very sure, you know, outside of here, there will be surprising Big Brother with, you know, let's say votes. That's why he came out from the previous season that they really came up with lots of gift ideas. And when he was renovating his house, you know, they were spoiling him. They were, they were like kind of asking him to keep them updated they were bringing house equipment household these furnitures and all that that in fact another fan base had to even set um a clubhouse to go discuss about his fan base that they were jealous of him other fan base were jealous of him other housemates were jealous of him and i'm like ah cool cool easy now islanders i hope you people are listening you know because people will definitely come through in a bigger way this time around though anyways Venita said even her own fan base the one thing she loves about them is that they know her very well and they've decided to stand by her that even sometimes they'll be like oh you're acting in a certain way we don't want but then they always stick with her 
and the uh, they said yes that one thing about fan base is that if you're acting a certain kind of way and they they get to like you for that particular way if at the dying moment you switch that that is where the problem is they'd be like uh uh-uh, is this person still you know the person they decided to fan or stand with Meanwhile, Somadina joined Alex and Doi's conversation. This time around, Kim was there as well. And Soma started telling them on how, when um, on a Monday, he decided to affirm himself, telling himself words of affirmation, how this week would be all about winning, how this week would go well for him. And that so forth, his affirmations have been manifesting, that he has been winning back to back last yesterday, the team he was in won. That it's been such a beautiful week for him. And I'm like, hey, it's the irony of life. Oh. Alex, that just complained now about not winning. You, you're here now. Telling us how your waste of affirmation came to pass. Anyways, I'm happy for some as well. And they should not even feel that way. Task will come. Task will continue coming to the last day. And they will definitely win. Shabby knew was not winning initially. But look at new now. HOH room white money has delivered as usual as he made a very delicious meal for them and he was even assuring them not to bother that tomorrow they would chop chicken he was even talking to Ilebaye in particular telling her not to bother that tomorrow they would chop chicken and she would get tired of chicken <laughs> and I'm like this is why Ilebaye is here now <laughs> this is the main reason why she'll be saying when she goes upstairs you know she will chop chicken and all that from there they started discussing about the house and Omashola said that only difficult part about being the HOH is the early morning alarm. That the alarm sounds so disturbing and you know once it sounds you must go wake the rest of the housemates up. And then he started talking about Coach um Coach Obi. And Messi said that particular coach is his personal trainer outside of the BBN house and that he trims Kim as well, but you know, they've been trying and making efforts to keep everything official out there in the sense that you know you know enter the gym and start forming familiarity with him now that he knows the outside messi even talked on how outside of here he always comes to her house anytime she misses gym he will come knocking asking to know why she has missed um training and sissy said well <laughs> that i really try you know if she was the one she would find it difficult keeping everything official while angel has been in her feelings she has been contributing Greatly towards the weather task presentation. Angel is currently writing a poem ahead of the weather task presentation, and this poem revolves around you know keeping the earth clean. And Perry has suggested that they give their trees a name, and even told um, Angel to please write poems about each of these three. And Venita as well was making a general appearance and why Perry was giving this contribution of his. It may seem as though Soma is not the only affirmator right now as White Money has joined as well. After the day, he went to the garden, encouraged himself and then he went ahead to say some prayers before going to bed. Thank you all for watching and enjoy the rest of your day. I will see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye. What task was that? Oh, yeah. That's nice. Happy to meet you.